I've seen quite a few videos trying to compare Goda and Rita, so I decided to ask the devs themselves what the difference is, and let's go over that. Rita is a fork of Godot 4.4. It has its own group of C++ developers that want to take Godot in a different direction. So the first step that they're going to do right now, if you download Rita, it's the exact same as Godot, right? So all your skills will transfer over. It doesn't really matter. And the only main difference that you can see right now upon trying Rita is just simply this, um, this sleek, dark skinned, red themed UI. But the difference between Rita and Godot is, or Godot, is that Godot engine has a ton of pull requests, right? There are tons and tons of bugs that have been accumulated over the last few years that just haven't been fixed and many of the audience who use Godot have been asking to get these fixed by the team and of course this is a lot of pull requests for a single open source team to handle on their own there are still way too many that have been swept under the rug in my opinion and they do have different priorities depending on I guess what serves the better portion of the audience but Redot's first priority is to simply go through all these bugs and fix them for their own engine so that is pretty much the main differentiation they're going to do first before adding on to any before adding on any features they want to for the Redot engine. And even though at the time of making this video there isn't much of a difference between Redot and Godot, I personally just recommend looking into both. It's always good for game engines to have competition just to push them forward, kind of like Intel versus AMD. There's always a reason to push forward and having a competitor will allow you to get information from other teams and even have your own pull requests. So for example, Redot can look at some of the stuff Godot is doing and Godot can look at what the Redot team is doing. Both teams consist of people with over 10 years of programming experience in C++, which is what both engines are made of. And since Redot is a fork of Godot engine, of course it is. Even though a lot of the community is saying that it's Godot or Godot versus Redot, and just know that it is way too early to judge your assumptions on how Redot's going to be. They do plan to take different directions and with bug fixes, quality of life, and then features in that order being added onto the Redot engine, just know that that both engines are great and viable and just use them as tools. It doesn't matter what game engine you use at the end of the day, as long as it gets your dream game out onto the Steam page or wherever you want to host it and so on. That's really the end goal for all of us. And that pretty much just covers the simple introduction to what Redot is and what the difference is between Redot and Godot. So long story short, there's no difference right now, but Redot is going to be focusing on the bug fixes that have been left in the Godot pull requests for the past few years. Thanks for watching Code Row. Like, subscribe, comment what you want to see next, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.